Donald Trump, Peyton Manning time. Um, just was watching some highlights from Peyton. But let's go to um, his top five seasons. Um, Peyton Manning's fifth best season is 20, 2006. And he had two MVP years that's not on. He had five MVPs, so you would think that would be the five best seasons, but it's not. Uh, 2008 and 9, honorable mentions. He won back to back MVPs with the Colts. And that that's the see uh, those seasons did make the top five to me. Um, I think it was too many interceptions. Yeah, one of them he threw 16 interceptions, one he threw 12. 12 was not bad, but only 27 touchdowns that year in 08. On um, the quarterback play stepped up though after that, too. Let's see. But anyway, Peyton Manning, there's no slight to pay, but I'm just saying. But 2006 was his fifth best season. That was uh, the year he they went 12 and 4. 65% completion is 4,397 yards, 31 touchdowns. He led the league, only nine picks. And he had a 274.8 yards per game, 101 quarterback rating. That was the highest, the 86.4 QBR. That was the highest he ever had in his career. So that's why that, that's one of the reasons why that made it. Um, and plus, they didn't start keeping that stat to 06, though. But still, 86 point, the first year they kept the QBR stat, Peyton Manning led the league, 86.4. His fourth best season was 03, his first MVP year. And that was uh, the year they went 12 and 4. They went 12 and 4. And then he threw for 4,000. Uh, this year he shared with Steve McNair 4,267, 29 touchdowns, 10 uh, interceptions, um, 266.7 yards per game. That was the most in the league. And then 99 quarterback rating. He didn't have 100, but I mean, 99 is pretty good, though. I'm talking about we talking top five. He got a lot of 100 quarterback rating seasons. Back to back, he had 04, 05, and 06. He had a 100 quarterback rating. And um, 2000, so he did that with two teams. For the Colts, he had three back to back 100 quarterback rating seasons 04, 05, and 06. And then he did the same thing in Denver with 2012, 13, and 14. And then that's when he just, the 15 year was like, you know, it was basically time for him to hang it up. But 2012 was the third best season. That was um, that was in Denver. They went six, 13 and 3 his first year in Denver. And it's coming off of four neck surgery. 68.6 completion percentage, the most in the league that year. 4,659 yards, 37 touchdowns, 11 picks. And with a brand new team, a new system, new coach, everything, with 291.2 yards per game, 105.8 quarterback rating. And then he, he led the lead in um, QBR again, 79.6. Peyton had a pretty doggone good career, man. Uh, his second best season, surprisingly, was uh, – his best season in Denver, 2013. That was his uh, last MVP, his fifth one. Uh, that's the year they went 13 and three. He did uh, lead the lead in passing attempts too, but that's why I put that the 04 season. I explained it in a minute, but um, 68.3 completion percentage. Uh, let's see, what's that year? 04. Um, 5,477 yards. That's the most in NFL history and the most that year, of course. 55 touchdowns, that was the most in NFL history. He broke Brady record with uh, 50 yeah, from 07. So the, the record held for like five years, but we'll see. Um, then he had 342.3 yards per game. I might have to reconsider then. But he threw the ball way more than he did in 04. But 342.3 yards per game, 150, that was the most in the league. 115.1 quarterback rating, that's ridiculous. And then 79, 79 QBR, that was just a four-time leading lead in QBR. This is the Peyton when he did it with two teams. I just put him up there, and then his best season was oh four. Uh, remember the Colts went, um, the Colts went f twelve and four, but they, I think they was thirteen and zero. I think, and then they um, that don't make no sense. I'm sorry, that was uh, that was oh five, but oh four, they was uh, I don't know what their record was, but the last three games Peyton was only playing one possession. I think so. Um, I probably should look at it real quick, but I'm gonna go through the regular stats. They went twelve and four. He threw sixty seven point. He completed 67.6% of his passes, 4,557 yards, 49 touchdowns, 10 picks, um, uh, 284.8 yards per game. And it was harder to pass back then, too. 121.1 quarterback rating, as high as ever. And then they didn't even keep track of QBR. I'm pretty sure it would have been like 86 or something, just like 06. But um, let's go to the game loss real quick. Let's see. I think I got to explain this one because people are going to be like 55. How was 55 touchdowns, 40, 49 touchdowns better than 55? But let's look at what he did. I got the game loss for 04. Let's see. So Peyton threw 13 games. They was, uh, they only lost one, two, three. They only lost three games. 
Oh, actually, I'm wrong. He had just did, um, I was wrong about that. But, um, uh, week 14, he did play. He, he threw two, 20 for 33 against Baltimore, one touchdown, no pick. And then, uh, week 16, game 15, they played the Chargers. They won by three. Peyton did play 27 for, he threw 27 for 44. It's just the last game that he didn't even play. He only, he only went one for two. And uh, had six yards, so he didn't, he didn't really play because it was already um, thirteen and no twelve and three at that point. Um, and that was enough to get you the bye week. Yeah. So I'm trying to see. Maybe he would have threw twenty more. Pa- well, he probably would have threw forty passes against the Colts. Yeah, the Colts put up thirty three points on their defense that year. I mean, the Denver. I keep getting it mixed up. He was on the Colts, but they went against Denver. And Denver put up 33 points on the Colts' defense. So Peyton would have been playing all the way to the end if they was trying to win, actually trying to win. But I'm just saying, that's a – if he would have threw – he would have threw 50 – maybe 51 touchdowns or 52 because he would have threw three probably that game. So still not the 55, but we got the, how many attempts he had, you know. So but that's Peyton Manning. His best season was um, 2004 with the Colts. And then 2000, the second best season was 2013 with the – Broncos, third best season 2012 with the Broncos, fourth best season 03 with the Colts, and then fifth best season 06 with the Colts. So three of those MVP, uh, three of those are MVP years. Um, two with Denver, I mean one with Denver, uh, two with uh, the Colts. Then his other two MVPs 08 and 09 with the Colts. They just wasn't good enough to make his top five. He played, he performed better than that in his career. But that's it, Peyton Manning.